Welcome to the Information Elevator. This is Lorne Vogelbaum, a co-host of Tech Stuff, a connoisseur of raspberries, and someone who has a healthy relationship with fire. When engaged in unpleasant conversation, she fantasizes about lobbing a plasma grenade at the offending orator. Perhaps this is because she's a top-notch conversationalist and a gentlewoman to the core, leaving her darkest thoughts at the doorway of fantasy rather than acting upon them. Thank you, Lauren. Right now, Lauren most likely wishes to transport herself from this elevator, and she may do so by closing her eyes and imagining herself as one with the universe. That's because she's made of star stuff, including the dust of the Big Bang. That's right, every atom in her body and ours is billions of years old. Hydrogen atoms were among the first particles to form just seconds after the Big Bang, making the ones in your body date back to 13.8 billion years ago. Heavier atoms like carbon and oxygen were forged in the dying light of stars that exploded some 7 to 12 billion years ago. The atom itself is composed of a nucleus made up of protons and neutrons bound together by attractive forces. The outer volume of the atom is occupied by electrons. We take atoms, basic units of chemical elements, for granted. The average adult is composed of seven octillion atoms. But here's where things get freaky deaky. Atoms are mostly empty volume. The nucleus of an atom is exceedingly small. In fact, it's about one one hundred thousandth of the size of the whole atom. Imagine a pea inside of a racetrack. That means that if Lauren wanted to compress herself into a cube less than one five hundredth of a centimeter on each side, all she would have to do is rid herself of empty atomic space. She'd be like a neutron star, collapsing in on herself, spewing solar plasma in a blaze of atomic glory. But not so fast, Lauren. For now you must remain whole, as atoms are incredibly stable, with the positive charge of an atomic nucleus and the negative charge of its surrounding electrons balancing each other out, preventing the atom from collapsing or flying apart. Patience. Thank you.